Hare Krishna, my name is Govinda Priya. I have often been asked how we can keep our homes clean and organized. Over these years, I have developed something that works for my family, and I'd be very happy to share them with you. Today, I'm going to share three points. My first point is teamwork. It is very important that everybody contributes towards keeping the home clean and organized. So in our family, my husband, children, we all contribute in some way to keep the house clean. The children make their own beds, they vacuum, they clean their rooms, um, you know, they put away the stuff, put away their clothes in places that they're supposed to be, they do the laundry. We all help to keep the house clean. So teamwork is very, very important. Point two is plan. Plan, plan, plan. I can't emphasize how important planning is. I take the time every week to meal plan. We as a family, the children decide what they want to eat over the week and what we want to cook for our deities. We plan. You know, I, I decide if I want to try a new recipe, we plan and organize a meal plan and that helps us organize a grocery plan. So we buy only the things we need that has eliminated waste to such a great extent for us. So plan, plan your meals, plan your grocery list. Also, we have a cleaning schedule. So there are certain areas in the house like you know, the living area, the dining, the kitchen, the family room that are used extensively and they need cleaning maybe twice a day. And I do that maybe twice a day or, you know, sometimes once a day, depending on how dirty and how used that area gets. But certain areas like the bedrooms, the guest rooms, they don't need cleaning every day. I have worked out a schedule, a cleaning schedule, where I clean two rooms, a deep clean, you know, cobwebs, change the comforters, um, you know, wipe the furniture, polish it. I do two rooms every day. So that way I have a list. Monday I clean the guest room and the office. That way I don't spend more than 20 minutes cleaning. And it has really, and because you're doing it repetitively, it really never seems like it gets dirty. So planning is a really, really important aspect. My point number three is organize. Organize. We've organized every little space in our house to suit our needs in such a way that everything has a place. I've taken the time to label, label everything, the spices, uh, the clothes drawers, you know, where the pants go. So everybody in the house knows what goes where. They can't give me an excuse that, oh, I didn't know where to put this. Everybody puts the stuff back because I took the time to label and organize. So if you have a place for everything that you own, then it's more likely to stay clean and organized. So just to recap, let's go over the three points again. Teamwork. Get your family engaged. You know, if you set a good example and you know, make it fun for the kids to clean. So teamwork. Second, plan. Plan your meals. Fix a cleaning schedule. Plan your grocery list. Save yourself from the decision fatigue. And three is take the time to organize. You can see a few pictures of how I've organized my home. And I hope all these three points help you.